are about to get even better because we have a very funny guest to bring to the table. You know him from Community and also from The Suit. Well, now he's got a new show called The Joel McHale Show with Joel McHale, obviously. <laughs> Please welcome, you guessed it, Joel McHale. <laughs> From you right there, that pencil, yes. kind of like, hmm. Yeah, I'm uh, smelling my finger. It's a little weird. <laughs> <laughs> this is clearly not George's seat since his is much higher, right? <laughs> too soon. Uh, too, too soon. Too soon. <laughs> too soon. Keep it warm, Joel. Don't, don't crush it. Uh, oh, well, good, good morning. Good morning, America. Good morning, to America. You. Good morning, America. <laughs> but, you know, we're, we're happy to have you here, man. And, and um, you know, hopefully you're having a good summer so far. But I just saw you just came from camping. It sounds like a lot of fun. Uh, I did. We were not stranded or anything. We did it on purpose. It was glamping. So uh, glamping is when you don't have to do anything. Uh, it's a hotel outside. Uh, so it's a bit of a ripoff. But uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, we went glamping. My wife and I ended up in a cornhole tournament. And I don't know if you know about Who won? cornhole. Who won? Okay, so it was a huge group. And it, it, we, ended, we were on separate teams. And we ended up in the final against, against each Woo. other. And my wife and I are very competitive. Uh, we both played a lot of sports. Uh, Michael, you know nothing what I'm talking about. Uh, <laughs> if you had tried more when you were playing football, you would have had some success. But uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm glad you had this to fall back on because uh, I know you needed the money. But um, I'm kidding. He literally has his own line of suits, you guys. <laughs> you know what the Wearing his <laughs> own I'm sitting there going, well, George isn't here, and I'm here, and you're still saying it to my face. You're, 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 you're a good man. Oh, no, I'm not. No, Robin, do you have your own line of clothes? No, I do not. I well, do let's, not. Let's I get, on it. get on uh, it. Let's get on it. Let's get on it. No, so then we're, uh, we're throwing uh, bean bags into a uh, hole, and it became very spirited and uh, very intense. I, I will say that uh, I, I did win uh, with my partner, and uh, I felt terrible, and I'm still reaping uh, that. Uh, I, but uh, we, there will be a, we've already scheduled a rematch. I mean, this is, we're, my wife and I have been so competitive that when we played tennis 20 years ago, and I won. She was like, great, we'll never play again. Uh, uh -huh. And then we started playing again, so it all actually. Well, you're celebrating your 22nd 22nd anniversary this wedding oh, anniversary. Yeah. 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 She is very nice to yeah. agree to continue to be married to me. Yeah. I'm, you were another tournament, a, a Fortnite tournament? Okay, so I don't know if you've heard of this video game called Fortnite, uh, but it's the most popular oh, yeah. thing on the planet right now. Yep. And my, my kids play it, and they said, hey, we don't ever have to go to college. Let's just do this. And, uh, <laughs> and I, I got into this Fortnite tournament, and I was playing against the 100 best players in the world. Are you good? And, uh, I'm terrible, but I'm playing people like Ninja, Myth, and Musel. Oh, okay. You know who that is, yeah, right? Sure, sure. I, those names, I just said them, and at home, kids, when there's kids that do some, <laughs> what? Ninja, <laughs> Myth, Musel? Uh, What'd you do? Well, the fur, you can hide in, in Fortnite, and I just hid like a coward <laughs> and just waited. But you and, survived? Yes, and then Ninja got eliminated before me in one round, and my kids were like, we are not horribly embarrassed by you now. <laughs> we can go out in public. But they were warning me. They were like, Dad, you suck at this, and you need to practice forever. And even my 13-year-old goes, he's like, I'm not the greatest at it, but I'm way better than you. <laughs> Get on it. So uh, I, for like five minutes, they, they liked me as a father. So it, was, it worked Gold. out. I was like, thank like you. That. Thank you for the pity. The pity clapping. Well, you thank know you. what? Well, we want to talk about the show. Let's do that. The Joe McHale Show with Joe McHale. How did you come up with the name? <laughs> well, uh, <laughs> so, uh, it was hard. It was weeks and weeks of uh, discussion. No, this way I've ensured that if they uh, fire me, uh, the replacement will be very awkward because if it becomes the Joel McHale Show with Michael Strahan, which <laughs> I, I don't doubt there's a future where that happens. Uh, uh, 
<laughs> then uh, they're going to have to change the whole thing. But yes, yeah, so I wanted to make sure that if people didn't catch my name the first time, it's, it's like I'm desperate. I'm in a desperate. <laughs> I just want to stay on Netflix. Well, we're going to watch a little clip. And the show, it has celebrity guests and the sketches and all that mm -hmm. stuff. But we're going to look at something here where you're going to, about one scene from the reality show, Shaws of Sunset, where you're discussing that. Yes. Ooh. So here's the Joel McHale show with Joel McHale. It's very intelligent. We spent 18 hours listening to music. And then we went to the beach. It was full moon. And we saw a white fox in the middle of PCH at 3 in the morning. Like, everything was an omen. Yes. What a great story. Do you have one that explains how straws work? For that entire clip, go to the show and you'll see <laughs> it'll make total sense. Jack Black's on the end of that one. So. Yeah, and you have a lot of celebrities on the show, as we were talking about. One of them, your community mm. co-star, yes. yes. Jillian, Jillian Jacobs. Jacobs. And there's then been some chatter about a community reboot, reunion. Yeah. You, well, what yes. say you? Uh, well, as everybody knows, uh, Donald Glover's career is tanked, and uh, <laughs> he's not a successful rapper, actor, uh, director, or writer, uh, so uh, he's been begging for it. Uh, <laughs> look, look uh, if Donald has the time, which he will in about 35 years, uh, then, then he'll die. And, and Dan Harmon just got picked up for 70 episodes of Rick and Morty. Uh, so it's, it's a little busy, and we want Michael to become one of the cast members, and he's, I don't have time. again, he's just he doesn't have time. He needs another show. He needs another Show. The other, yeah, he needs one more show <laughs> and needs to start working out more. I need a twin. Why? That's what I want to know. Why haven't you exercised since you retired? I don't know. I just <laughs> figure why. Who yeah, am I you twin? should get back in shape. It's I know. Really, I don't know why. Been you don't. slacking lately. <laughs> yeah. Wait, you played football, right? Oh yeah, I played football. Look at that bill. He did. <laughs> you did play football. Uh, yeah. Okay. This you is. Did. This is the difference between. Yeah, you're right. Uh, <laughs> but this is the difference between me. Uh, the, my football was getting. A Twinkie at a uh, like a gas station, and he was the uh, porterhouse steak that uh, cost two hundred fifty dollars. He would have ripped. Yeah, he would have torn my arms off and beaten me with my own what arms. What position did you play? I played tight end on a. Oh, uh, you would have had a field day. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he would have hit me so hard yes. my ancestors would have felt it. That's, it would have, yeah, no, I, it would have when been I fun. see someone like him running down the field, just running and crying, and I'm like, Michael Strahan's chasing me! Run for your life! So, yeah, no, I, I, it, we can't, I, yes, I played poorly on a very good uh, college team, and he played very well in the most competitive league. So it's not, there's no sort of, I'm sure Amy would have hit me harder <laughs> than I was hitting people out there. I tell you right now, man, you can come back anytime. Oh this is I'll come back tomorrow. You've been my See biggest cheerleader. You've been my biggest cheerleader. See you tomorrow. But you know what I love? We were talking about this downstairs. Birthdays. I wish we had a cake because you're November 20th. I'm November 21st. And I'm the 23rd. 23rd. Yeah. Really? Yeah. And Amy, February, about, February 6th, sorry. Oh. <laughs> okay. And Amy had the birthday. How about that? That's yeah, so. All right. Um, well, then I'm coming back on my birthday. Yes, yes. you are. We have the cake. Uh, all right. I'll see you then. I'm turning 34. Turning 34. 34. Yep. I'll, I'll be launching my clothing line with Michael now. Oh, yeah. on, the, on our birthdays. How about that? But we, we, we love it when you're here, man. <laughs> Thank you for and having me. We just me. know everybody's going to love this show. The Joe McHale Show with Joe McHale. It's streaming <laughs> now on Netflix. Make sure you go check out Funny Man. Watch it on Netflix. <laughs>